What's going on, stream gang? Got a little bit of a mail day here for everybody. Um, I'm going to do a video this weekend, and it's going to talk about a lot of the new product coming out, what happened and everything, but we'll save that for uh, this weekend. I, I've been uh, meaning to do uh, a couple other videos, but with all the recent events, I pretty much uh, pulled off just because of what's going on out there. But let's take a look. I cannot remember what's in each package. I should have some more mail yet tomorrow coming. So we'll open that up live on camera. I, I really don't remember what this break's from. These are both from breaks. Oh, Tops Heritage. Boom, boom. So we got, I had the White Sox on a random team break. We were hoping for Luis Robert, Robert to his friends. And you see, I'm not wearing any gloves today, so we were saving our gloves up. Um, and I, I'm trying to think, Nick Madrigal was the auto we were chasing. There were autos of Luis Robert, but you needed to have a coin with an auto. I'm just looking to make sure there's nothing crazy on any of these. These are all base rookies of him. Not too sure really what they sell for. I'm going to look at them. A couple I might send off to PSA in about three months when they all everybody decides to open back up. Yes, it's true. I'm trying to see what's on, what's on the case. So three, four, five, six, seven. And this here should just be a stack of uh, base here. Oh, there's a couple sleeved in here. Let's see what was sleeved. Probably the insert, yeah. Luis Robert. Nick Madrigal. Fresh scene. There's our Madrigals. Dave Dunning. Who else was in this? Pillington. Hollins. Cease. Pretty much it. So, not too bad. This here was a cheaper end break. It was one of those ones where if you pull the Luis Robert auto, it's it's going to be awesome. Especially since they were very limited. Or even a Madrigal. Alright, let's take a look here. Uh, this is another break. Maybe two breaks combined. I'm not too sure offhand. Bada bing. What's out here? Oh, a lot of top loads. Oh, yeah, I saw one. One break. I wasn't too sure if he sent off the uh, football mixer with this or not. So I had random teams. I think I, want, uh, I got into Prism Draft football, spent like 20 bucks. And I end up hitting a filler spot for some random for a random team. We hit, boom, Air Alabama, the Crimson Tide, roll tide roll. God, I used to have to hear it every day at work. All right, let's take a look here. So, I have no idea on some of these guys. McKinney at two ninety nine. A lot of these are going in the store, guys. And by the time I actually, well, I forgot I'm uploading this video today because I was going to do some videos just to have ready. Uh, probably be in the store maybe tomorrow. Tua's. Tua, green and purple rookie. I believe this is out of 199 So we got one Tua. Henry Ruggs, the wide receiver guy. And I've heard a lot of good stuff about him. Orange Auto out of 149. These just look so gold to me right off the bat, but they're actually orange. Can we at least get a little focus today, camera, please? Now I just want to go completely crazy. There we go. Really nice. Got an Amari Cooper out of 199, too. And then the Xavier McKinney. Mm, I'm trying to remember what the name of this is. 
Oh, it's not two ninety nine. It's not hitting me. Wave. <clears throat> right. Any more two as we got here. Stefan Diggs. This will be the wave out of two ninety nine. I'm just separating them as I do these. Jerry Jayudi, I don't know how to say his name, out of 99. This is the red, white, and blue checkerboard. Crusade is Josh Jacobs. That's pretty cool looking out of 49. See, I put these out of my reach, and now I'm like trying to hit the camera. Uh, blue Terrell Lewis will be out of 30. Pretty cool. Tua again. I forgot about this one. It is not numbered. Hmm. But purple. Amari Cooper, orange, out of 149. Riggs, uh, green, purple, out of 199. Derrick Henry, out of 249. Let me toss these wrappers off to the side here. Maybe I saved the best stack for last for everybody. It just happened to be that way. Xavier McKinney, again. This will be out of 249. Mark Ingram, 299. Wave. Do we have any faces of uh, Tua? Oh, here they come. Derrick Henry, and that'll be out of 199. Tua Silver, not number, of course. Then it came up to this. Tua. Tell me that is. Okay, I was just buzz. Orange Auto out of 149. 125. Sorry, they changed these on the autos. Really beautiful hit. Just came off sticker with down here, but still beautiful auto. It'd be something PSA worthy. Mark Ingram wave, uh, two ninety nine. Xavier McKinney wave, and Amari Cooper. And that'll be out of two forty nine. I believe there was no uh, base tours. And I'm trying not to. Well, I guess I'll just have to do some wiping of cards. I'm just gonna look through here real quick. There's a base to a two base to us. Those actually sell for a decent little chunk of money. Nothing real hard, but we'll get them cased up here and wiped down from my fingers touching them. But I ferment there. I was like, wow, there's no base to us. That's really odd, but there's two of them. So really was a good break for like 20 bucks. I was in on this. I mean, you can't beat it, especially with a two auto orange. Oh, trying not to sneeze on this. Hold on, guys. I just came in outside with the dog. She wanted to go outside, and pollen got to me. So some nice tuas, four different tuas. You got the uh, orange auto out of 125, the silver, a purple, and then uh, I guess this is the purple green. Plus a Riggs Auto out of uh, 149. Why are they different numbers? Huh. I guess they just limited them or something. And then you got two two of bases and a whole stack of yummy stuff way in the back here with all the different prisms. So I'll get a lot of this stuff put in the store sometime tomorrow before we go live. That way, in case anybody's interested, it'll be on there. I'm not too sure where the two is yet, where I'm going to be out on to them, but I'll look them up. Uh, I'll probably give you guys first chat uh, crack at them in a store. And, of course, as always, they'll be lower than eBay. So that way, in case anybody's really a two-a-die-hard fan already, they can pick them up for 
a little bit cheaper on eBay. Well, that's it for my mail day, everybody. As I said, mail is running very, very slow. And that's just due for the fact that they don't have as many workers as they used to have out there with uh, COVID-19 going on. And uh, what usually takes two to three days is taking around seven business days to get to me. Um, even stuff from out of New York uh, that was shipped out last week, Thursday, is just getting to me tomorrow. It just arrived in Louisville, so... If you guys are out there looking for mail, you see that, it, you know, the tracking says it's going to be arriving late. It's going to arrive late. I haven't had anything arrive on time yet. Everything's at least been two days late. Other than that, I am out for the day. I'm going to go enjoy some TV here tonight. You guys stay safe and healthy out there. And I hope you guys had a pretty good Thursday. I couldn't believe it's already Thursday. Tomorrow's Friday. we got tribute that will be here on time. UPS is delivering on time. I will say that, though. It's just a regular post office. All right, I will talk to you all later.